So before the free ride ever even got off the ground at HO, we looked at what skiers needed. We have a huge competitive market. We're making great skis for the competitive market. We're making the top end skis of our syndicate line. But we weren't addressing this huge demographic of skiers who are on public lakes, who are on open waters, on rivers. We didn't have a ski for them. Nobody had a ski for them. Bob, Dave Wingerter, everybody kind of put their heads together and said, what are we gonna do about this? We came up with a free ride. What we ended up with was not only a ski that was easy to get up on, but this is the easiest, most fun ski. I'm not joking. This thing is unbelievable to ski on. I don't even wanna ski on my real ski sometimes when I put the free ride on because it's so light, so fast, so free, and I'm going 26 and 28 miles an hour. It's just absolutely unbelievable. You really have to ride one. The first thing you notice is what we like to call clean edge technology. It's a wakeboard style edge in the back half of the ski. A traditional water ski has a bevel, and the bevel allows the water to wrap around the sides of the ski and shoot off the top of the edge. Clean edge technology eliminates the bevel and has a wakeboard angled side edge. And this reduces up to 50% of the drag a conventional ski has. But it has a more traditional slalom ski sidewall up in the forebody, which provides a lot of support and a nice stable platform the skier to balance on as it uses the front of the ski. The free ride is actually something that we've been talking about and it's been in a conceptual design stage for a couple years now. Marcus Brown was real instrumental on pushing that project and uh, we're pretty excited about it. We took a serious look at some of the other sports like surfing and, and wakeboarding. We took some of the elements from that. From uh, wakeboarding, we actually took the reverse sidewall. You know, we don't have an outbound sidewall now. We have a, an inbound sidewall, which creates a lot of low drag, especially in the back half of the, of the board. Uh, from surf, we looked at shapes. We took some elements out of the sh shape. We looked at bottoms of surfboards. Instead of a, a traditional concave, we have a flat concave with walls on it, something that you, would, you wouldn't typically see on a, on a water ski. Uh, you really got to look at it up close to see all the, all the different things we've done, but it's created a ski that's probably the easiest thing to get up on, the easiest thing to ride out there. The free ride's easy to get up on, light and fast on the water, has that clean edge that makes all that possible. We compensated by giving it steeper entry concave, which allows the ski to hold when it's on edge, through the wakes, through the chop, gives it a stable, carvable ski that ultimately addresses the issues that lake skiers have been dealing with for years. The finishing touch on the free ride is an all new fin shape, the shark fin. Similar to a surfboard fin, it's much deeper with a cutout in the back that allows the ski to turn exceptionally well. This deeper fin allows really good edge hold in rough water conditions and it's a fun, surfy, carvy feel that you'll enjoy behind the boat every time you ride. The all new free ride is offered in four sizes, 65, 67, 69, and 71. And like all HO water skis, it's handmade in the United States. So throw a pair of basis boots on the all new free ride and prepare to have your mind blown for how fun water skiing can truly be.